Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Erica. You can also call me Glossy Boss or Glossy Erica, whatever makes you comfortable. Today's video is a little different. We're at Target today doing some hygiene shopping. I thought I would take you guys with me. Um, fortunately, I just re up on a lot of the products that I use, but there are some things I need to replace. There are some things I need because I'm going out of town this weekend and I'm traveling and also just wanted to show you some products that I'm really liking that I got from Target lately. Y'all know I'm a product junkie. <laughs> I have a problem and you also know that i am a hygiene girly i'm really big on hygiene so i thought i've been seeing these videos on youtube and i'm like oh i should do one because i love watching them so let's go shopping okay guys so we're getting deodorant i've tried dove's whole body stick um i wasn't that big of a fan I feel like between them and Lumi, definitely love Lumi. And for their whole body deodorant, it's like a cream to powder type situation. The uh, soft powder one, I love this one. It smells so good, but I don't need it because I just got some. Um, and then I also, as far as like chafing sticks, babes. This thigh rescue, fire. Take it everywhere with me, okay? Give me 14 of them right now. has cleansers they look so good but I don't know they're cheaper than Eterium I don't know if I would try them grapefruit grapefruit and lang lang coconut shea these are probably fire I want to try them but not for me so Naturium body washes are top tier if you didn't already know so I've used the glow getter I like this one a lot actually um I also like the glycolic one try that one is really good and the salicylic one, tried that really good. But the star of the show, babes, the star of the mother freaking show, this one. This is the one I've been using lately. It's called the Energizer with Mandelic Acid. Mandelic Acid is actually really good for hyper treating hyperpigmentation on African American skin. So I'm obsessed. And it, it's like um, antibacterial. Babes fire literally it's worth the $16 I think out of all of them this is my favorite so far I've been using it literally every day so I'm obsessed so I don't need any right now but obsessed I've also like Solterre's um body wash is okay mostly just for the smell as far as like skin benefits not so much this one's really good um, so I think as far as scents are concerned they got it but yeah I don't need body wash today just want to show you some of the ones I've used I also like this one smells so good but once again, like benefits of skin, not so much. Also, Dove has an antibacterial soap. Speaking of antibacterial soap, Dove has one I really like. Um, but then also there's Good Old Dial. I like this too, but I tend to like Dove's more because it's moisturizing. So, yeah. Why are toothbrushes so expensive? Okay, so I like these flossers, but they are a little flim I mean, tongue scrapers, they're a little flimsy. I like these because they're disposable, but the flimsiness I can't get with, so instead I use a stainless steel one. I've never used their um, flossers before. Never used their flossers. What are the ones I usually get? wash I use right now act it's cheap it's really good I have used like their breath and stuff before but I'm not a big fan of them my mouth just doesn't feel clean I don't know I still am with the no alcohol but I want I still want the the mouthwash to like moisturize my mouth my, my gums and stuff Crest has a mouthwash now I've never seen this before but I don't know if I'm gonna try this today I tend to like 
normal mouthwash but right now this is the one i'm using i usually use this to remove but i'm really liking this one it doesn't burn your mouth makes me feel clean freshens my breath all of that and it has fluoride in it okay so now we're in the feminine aisle um all pad girly i do um tampons too sometimes but i'm mostly a pad girly but they don't have the ones I like currently. Um, but I know I'm gonna do diapers all day. So I get those off of Amazon. But for Target, I do come in here for their pads and panty liners. I like honey pots, pads and panty liners because they have like, um, they're herbal infused. So it's almost like you're eating a piece of gum. I'm sorry. And I like, um, who else? Uh, what is the brand? It's called. Oh, here they are, right there. Here's the pony cup. Pony cup bag. So I use these. I like the overnight ones with wings. I use these. I also like the. Uh, they have like some regular smaller ones I use for like light flow. But I like Honey Pots pads. I like them a lot, and they're cotton, so it doesn't have like all the um, chemicals and stuff. And then Rayel. Braille pads, I love. These are another one of my favorites. So, they have period underwear in here. I didn't even know they sold period underwear. Okay, from Target. I mean, they don't sell big booty period underwear. Hmm. This goes up to a 16. So, yeah, but okay. Oh, that's for teens. Okay, and then we have the ones for all. And these are extra large. And they go up to 47 inch hips. That's pretty good. What's that? I don't know what size that is. It's not me. <laughs> like the Clean Tangerine, their body wash is really, really good. Like really, really good. But I don't need that today. I have, I kind of stopped using it, but I do like it. Um, and then the whole body deodorant also comes in just cream. I like that too. But yeah, the Tangerine, the Clean Tangerine is probably my favorite, my favorite scent. And then I also like to get wipes sometimes. So honey pot wipes are really good. And I like these because they come in like individual packages. So I like that. You can just slip a couple in your purse. Um, but I have some at home, so I don't need those. And then I also like these wipes as well. They're called down there wipes. They're flushable. They're pH balanced. They're hypoallergenic and all of that good stuff. So I like these too. Um, honey pot has other wipes that, that are like in a package like that too, but yeah, I don't need any right now. I want to try a shaving oil, but it's either between this one or this one, whatever. But they kind of don't smell like anything, so I don't know. Okay, I normally really like uh, Dr. Barnett's bar soap, but they don't have the unscented one. That's the one I use, the baby unscented. Except I use the, the bar soap, they don't have it, so. Can't get that. <sighs> okay, well. I also try to pick up the um, new loofah when I go out of town, like to travel. I like to use these. So I'm gonna pick up one of these. And I also, I've heard such good things about dry brushing. I think I wanna grab a dry brush. They're only $6. Okay, well, this is like my favorite skincare line, but they've locked up everything. But I use the Gentle Foaming Cleanser, except it's usually blue. Oh no, it's right here. The purifying foam cleanser. That's what I use. I use this for cleansing. I love the moisturizer. I like the one that has SPF as well. Um, what else do I like? I like the triple repair moisturizing cream. It's super thick. <laughs> like I like. Um, what else do I like from there? I like their SPF that they have down there. 60, 50. We're not really seeing a lot of numbers like that. It's really, really good. <sighs> I think that's it.
what they have that I use, but this is literally like my favorite skincare brand. Another clean girl hack is Witch Hazel. After you got the shower, there's so many places on your body where bacteria just breeds. So I know your body's clean and everything, but I still like to wipe this in any places where I think I will be sweaty. And I like the Thayer's because it's alcohol free and I like the Rose one. They have other scents as well, but I like this one. But once again, I don't need it. <laughs> Actually, I could use a little one to take with me. I'm gonna go see if they have the little ones over there to take with me. But I'm looking at these underarm deodorant wipes by Pacifica. These look kind of cool. Underarm with auto with coconut milk. I kind of want to try them to $8.99. I don't know, this looks kind of cool. I mean, I would have to use it with, with deodorant. <laughs> I've definitely, I'm gonna try them because I've definitely used their underarm detox scrub, um, coconut and charcoal, and I really like it. Like when I was trying to use like natural deodorants, I would use this every so often and I feel like it made a difference. So yeah, I still have some actually, but I think I am gonna try these. Okay, so you always have to have a purse lotion. My purse lotion is Nivea's little cream. So I like to buy these. They're like literally over a dollar. And the, I'm not usually like a lotion girl, but when I do put on lotion, it's always gonna be the Nivea Deep Nourishing Sam, Serum. Serum. It's always gonna be this one. <laughs> um, Cause it's like, dry to very dry skin it leaves your skin like super moisturized and it lasts all day like sometimes when i wear lotion i feel like it doesn't always last the whole day but this one or sometimes i'll like put on lotion at night when I, after i take a shower and then in the morning i'm ashy so that is the goat and then also of course y'all know the og the vaseline baby oil situation well this is not baby oil but they have baby oil gel but this is the vaseline one this is the one i usually get this EOS lotion, I hated it. It stinks so bad. I don't know what you guys are talking about. This stinks. Ew. So I don't want to try any of the others. That's why it's full. Because <laughs> it stinks. And it really wasn't even that moisturizing. If I'm going to use lotion, give me lotion. Like, give me something that's really going to moisturize me. I'm a butter girl. So that's why I really love the, the Nivea. Okay, I apologize, you guys, if you can hear the air conditioning. But it's hot outside. So anyway... We're gonna go over what we got from Target. Okay, so I spent about a little less than $100, which is not bad. I wasn't planning on spending that much, <laughs> but um, it is what it is. I got a whole bunch of little things. Yeah, so anyway, let's show what I got. Some of you already saw. Like I said, I like to take a loofah with me when I go out of town um because i don't i use um african net sponges at home and i don't like taking them with me i don't know i just like these because they carry a lot of bacteria in them and i only use them when i buy them a couple of times before i throw them away anyway so taking these with me when i travel is just chef's kiss i also picked up a bar of soap to take with me and travel even though i feel like i probably already have soap so that's annoying. I buy some, I bought some Clorox wipes to wipe things down like in the hotel, traveling, plane, all that good stuff. And just to keep in your purse in general. And then I bought these wipes for your hands. Of course I have hand sanitizer, but sometimes I wanna wipe off my hands with something versus rubbing it in with with um, <laughs> with a uh, hand sanitizer. I travel toothbrush, cause I don't like taking my toothbrush all the time. And this one actually has a cover. So when you take this out and you flip up the white part, that's right here um you you push down the tooth the toothbrush and it covers um it's hard to explain but it looks like this in the picture if you can see so yeah i like taking these to go what else i also picked up this is like the this is like a skincare key okay micellar water i use this morning and night 
um, before I wash my face, I use it to take off makeup. Makeup wipes themselves are abrasive on my skin. I don't know, my skin always gets irritated using makeup wipes and I've used all kinds. The only ones that don't really bother my skin I think are the Simple brand, um, but other, otherwise, make and Clinique's take the day off wipes. I love those. But they're like twenty four dollars. I don't always want to spend twenty four dollars. My cellar water is really cheapy, and I um, I particularly like the one that's aloe in. Um, it doesn't say it on here, but the one in the blue top is I think it's aloe and hyaluronic acid. So I really like this. I use the big one at home, but I use the little one when I travel. These are like uh, flushable wipes. I like to take with me in a little bag. I also bought some for home, but um, I'm not at home. I don't flush these. So. But at the hotel, I don't care. <laughs> it's Lysol spray, you already know, and a travel lint brush, and some mouthwash. So all these were from like the travel section. I also picked up some Mighty Patches. I love these. In fact, I need it right now because I have a huge pimple on my chin. But I bought the little ones because I just didn't need a whole pack and I tend to lose them. So rather than pay all that for a big one, I just bought the little travel size but i really like these mighty patches these honestly these are the only pimple patches i've ever used um i know cosx cosx i don't know how you pronounce the brand the one that does the snail mucin i know they have some pimple patches i know that also um who else has pimple patches um there's something called star or something actually there's a lot of people who have pimple patches but these are the only ones i've used so far and i like them these have the invisible and the original the invisible are what i normally buy it's for like daytime so people can't really see it but this has both i don't shave um the only thing i shave is my legs and i haven't shaved them this year <laughs> i don't really grow a lot of hair on my legs so i really literally shave like once a summer and i haven't done it yet so i'm going to shave i just bought some cheap razors literally nothing to them but instead of shaving cream i want to try shaving oil so i picked up this tree hut shaving oil and vanilla the vanilla is okay because it's just a shaving oil i don't mind this and the scrub I didn't like i don't like this vanilla vanilla it's like a fake vanilla smell i'm not a big fan of it but for shaving oil it's fine it's not a big deal um and i also picked up some a new toothbrush okay you guys this is literally my favorite toothbrush why i don't even know if you can really tell but this is like a wide brush and it just makes me feel like i'm covering more of my teeth i don't know i just love this toothbrush it's the oral b cross action all in one I literally love this toothbrush. It massages your gums. I just love it. And then this is currently my favorite toothpaste by Colgate. This is the Total Whitening. It has 24 hour antibacterial protection. It's just a solid good toothpaste. I have snail mucin because I'm run I ran out. And I also got this dry brush. Um, it wasn't a necessity, but I really want to try dry brushing um, in my uh, self-care routine. In my shower routine before i get in the shower so i want to try to see see how i like it hopefully you guys enjoyed our little trip to target um literally my favorite place on earth other than trader joe's and i didn't need a lot of things today but i did get to, i'm glad they had a lot in stock that i got to show you guys they didn't have everything there are a couple other things i wanted to show you guys as far as what i use in my personal hygiene routine but um there's, there will be other days there'll be other times and let me know if you guys like videos like this um if you want to join me in the future when i do my hygiene shopping let me know if you have any questions about any products that you saw or any recommendations like y'all know i love a good product okay so yes definitely let me know if you guys have any other recommendations and i will see you guys in the next video bye beauties